Hello there everybody, it's Wayne Robson here. Um, this is a workaround um, for those of you that have models such as this one. I'll just quickly step down a little subdivision level. That have a multiple set of UVs across a number of tiles and you've already got your textures painted. Um, if you simply want to paint it normally, all you do is create a new layer. Okay, But if you have already painted maps that you wish to get into Mudbox with all the UVs and all the textures in the right places. This is the workaround for it, okay? Uh, it'll work for now. First of all, you take your model, you create a 256 bit texture, like that. That's it, right? And I'm going to save this out. I've already done a test here, so I'll call it Multi 2. You wonder what this is, it's just something I'm doing for uh, for my son, he's three. Alright, now if we quickly jump over, these are, um, when I get Photoshop selected, right, I've got three textures, they're not the uh, world's best, but they've got all the colours um, where we need it, okay, so the black bits uh, along here, our boots, uh, that's an arm, the other bit along here is skin, you know, etc, etc. This is what you do. Now these are my textures here. If we look inside here, you've got a number of black textures. You need to name each one of your textures, all right? Because you'll have them, I'd imagine, or you should have them named, you know, in order one, two, three, okay? And you just copy that name, all right, for each of those in order for these, all right? Now I've already done it, I'll put them uh, just in a list so you can see, and there's the name, default material, paint layer 1, UV1, dash V1, UV2, dash V1, UV3, dash V1, okay? So we can take those there, copy them in this case because I've already got them prepared, alright? Just quickly put that on the list, and then Vista will have a damn good whinge at me. Right. And there you have that, right? Now, what you need to do now is we go back into Mudbox and we will open this file and something magical will happen. There you go. There's all your textures in the right place. You can then do whatever you need to do with them. As I say, it is a workaround. It'll work for the moment. Uh, for those of you that are uh, in the doggy doo-doo and need to uh, get a multiple UV set uh, texture inside a mud box. I hope that helps you all. Um, the idea for this goes to Dave Cardwell. Uh, he asked me to just quickly knock this uh, video out for those of you that have been inquiring. Okay, I hope that helps. Bye bye.